I've got a grasp on the Cherub situation. So, do you care to tell me where I can find the Ophan and Seraph? Dunno. It's been ages since anyone in the kingdom has seen either of them. Oh, it's only a legend, then. There are some misguided believers who have convinced themselves that the stone statue at the Wishing Shrine is actually the Ophan. But it's fine. They'll get divine retribution for that someday. Can it be possible that the idol actually was the Ophan? I was once a beautiful sight to behold. A symbol of purity. But many years of granting wicked wishes to humans turned me into this. Still don't have enough information to form a proper plan just yet. I've got to gather more intel in the Holy Capital. But before I can do that, I guess I'd better do something about this empty wallet of mine. In my motherland, we've traditionally had a strong appreciation for taste and elegance. So everyone always presents their finest wares when serving tea. In fact, you're considered an embarrassment to your family if you dare to put out something that looks cheap. Well, goodness, that certainly is interesting. So, today, I've brought my very favorite tea bowl from my motherland with me. It's incredible! Look how splendid it is! Right, is in this trash I literally just made with a few skill points and that only gives one offense? I just don't get it. So, tell me, how much would it cost for you to part with it? No, no, no. I'd like for you to think of this as a small token, given only in hopes of establishing a long-lasting partnership. However, seeing as how I don't have very much money on hand, I'd be happy to accept one giant gold coin as collateral, if you're willing. Um, one giant gold coin? That looked like the most expensive coin in Luna's bag by far, so I figured I should probably start with that, but who knows, I guess. I've heard all those incredible rumors about you, you know. They whisper that you're a cultured guy, even descended from royalty, as well as a very tolerant, accepting gentleman. <laughs> <laughs> Who would dare go around spreading baseless rumors like that? Look, I'm sure you must have your own reasons for denying it, but I can promise you I won't tell anyone else about it, so no need to worry. I'll gladly accept your proposition. Let me go get things ready for you. I appreciate your understanding. But before that, I think it's important that I tell you something. <sighs> If you end up selling the tea bowl, you need to be sure to take nothing less than five giant gold coins in exchange for it. You got that? Whoa! Five giant coins? Are you positive? If you can't promise me that, then let's just pretend like this conversation never happened. No, wait, please! I understand. I promise to honor your wishes. Holy crap! That sold for a ton more than I thought it would! The value of stuff here is way different than an Infinity game. Cool. I'll invite Aku and Luna to dinner or something. Luna, get out here! As you know, much to our disappointment, we demon-believing Satanists failed in summoning the Demon Lord. But if it resulted in the Holy Maidens mobilizing and taking action, then I say it was not done in vain. We will eradicate the Holy Maidens from this world just as we had originally planned. May disaster befall the Holy Maidens. May it befall every one of them.